All right, guys, it is here. Um, so just complete pie recordings, 1963 to 67, when you walk in the room. Long title. I said it in such a wrong order. Um, but, you know, I had more time to figure everything out on how I was, was going to do it. Because it came while I was outside helping my grandpa put Christmas lights up. So I had more time to think about, you know, what I was going to do. So I have scissors this time. So, you know, that's a, that's a, that's a step up. Um, I know it is what it is because it's, it's, it's literally in the shape of a CD set. Especially since it's more, you know, there's, it's more chunky, so. It's really weird packaging this time. It was a bit odd. You know, at first I wasn't 100% sure it was. But I'm like, it's gotta be, you know. Um, so. And sure enough. We have. The Searchers, complete pie recordings when you walk in the room, 1967. Wow. It's got all of the songs right on the back. So it's basically in the same format as the Monkees Classic Album Collection. But this is even better. See the side there. Nice little labeling and stuff. Um, pretty odd a picture to pick as the cover, but it's cool that... They picked this one because, you know, as you can see, they're looking up, you know, but they look miserable. You know, that's not a very, the best way to, you know, give off a set, but, you know, who am I? So, I'm ready to break into this thing. Um, you know, if it'll cooperate. And like I said, it's in the same exact format. As the more uh, as the monkeys classic album collection, you just got the little gatefold. And again, we open it up, and sure enough, you've got the five albums. Read the searchers, sugar and spice. It's the searchers. Sounds like, and. Take me for what I'm worth. And then you've got the disc of nine album singles. Same thing as, you know, um, the monkeys one. But there's something even more special about... Let me take out one of these CDs and I'll show you what it looks like. Um, so, got the little thing. And I think this one's even cooler than the other one. No, I was wrong. Uh, let me just double check real fast. Pretty nice stuff here, um, honestly. And then, this one's yellow. Which is a bit weird because the rest of them are red. You know, maybe it's because of bonus disc and stuff, but you know. Um, so again, we have the book here. Oh, wow, this is cool. You guys will get a look at this, so. Here's the book. Here's the back. It's just, like, advertising for other people that they come out with. Um, you know. Um, got really rare pictures. Never seen any of these before. Um, I've seen some of them, you know, like that one. That's a pretty common photo, but, um, you know. So that's pretty cool. Oh, John McNally meets Jerry Lee Lewis. Pretty cool. And this is going to take a whole lot of reading. But I'm just giving it the lowdown, you know. Nice picture of Mike. Secret of the Searchers breakup. And then Billy J on the top, which is weird. Um. Couple of nice shots. Oh, Frank meeting Smokey Robinson is pretty cool. Searchers with a bunch of other Liverpool acts like uh, Blee J and the Beatles and Scylla. Nice shot of the band. I've never seen that one before. Nice shot at Chris. So, 
as you can see now, um, we're getting a bit later into their career. So this is like the later searchers, which I think are much less desirable than the early searchers for a lot of people. So then we've got this, and then it's got its chords. These are all the EPs right here. Um, and then it shows each song and um, who wrote it and that kind of stuff. Um, and it shows the last and then that picture, which is probably the most common picture of them. And then the book. Um, let's give you one more look at the box. And then the album one more time. And hope you all enjoyed. Bye.